After being accused of only giving juicy position to Yoruba Christians, Islamic li- Tinubu replied Islamic leaders, you must respect the will of Allah. Don't provoke me. Wow. Simply wow. So, Morik, the Islamic movement group, accused Ashiwajo Ahmed Bola Tinubu, said they were the ones who stood with him and for him when Christians in the country were fighting against the Muslim Muslim ticket. He said now Tinubu is president, and guess what? All Tinubu remembers is the Christian Muslim, Christian uh, Yorubas that stood against him. Now he's giving them all the juicy position. In fact, he named all the five uh, you know, economic uh, uh, position that Tinubu have given to Christian Yoruba, saying he has put the economy, the whole of Nigeria, in the hands of Yoruba Christians, that the North we stood for him. In fact, trying to incite, that's Morik, okay, Akintola, Akintola uh, trying to, you know, incite the people against Tinubu, saying that uh, Tinubu, you know, is working against them. He came, they supported him, and now he's doing other things. You see, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Tinubu replied, Islamic leaders, who says he's neglecting them and giving all the position to Yoruba Christians. You must respect the will of Allah, Tinubu tells them. President Bola Ahmed Tinubu has replied and has stated that Islamic leaders in the continent of Africa and in Nigeria especially, must respect the will of Allah. Tinubu said this when he welcomed the Secretary General of Organization of Islamic Cooperation in New York on Tuesday. He said back home, I'm being accused of picking only those in Christian, only, only those who are Christians to work in Nigeria's economy that is gradually we're working on to begin to pick up. I find it very unfortunate because all I'm doing is not your region or religion, but your capacity and what you can bring to the table, irrespective of where you're from. These people are now speaking, trying to incite my very own brothers against me. This is not right. And this is what I am talking about. This is not something that should be allowed. We must forget about religion, region, and we must build on strength, capacity, so that we can get this nation to work. According to his special advisor on media and publicity, Jerry, the president reiterated that Islam world has a strategic role to play in the in sustenance of peace and development of Africa across the globe. The effect we are making, the efforts we are making in is to, is very important. We know we must double our efforts. We must tell all our brothers who are struggling to, to steal power that only God chooses leaders. We must respect the will of God. I am ready to collaborate with you, your efforts in supporting agriculture, growth, food security, through provision of resources from the Islamic Bank has been most commendable and our region is really enjoying this. I'm determined to work with you in uplifting Nigeria and Africa, the president assured. The leader of the 57 nation body cooperation praised Nigerian's president for his active efforts in bringing Africa states to a place common, com- common with common understanding. We must gain we must gain all the needed peace in order for us to stay together as one. It gives us confidence to and hope to know that the situation in in the in the country in the country and in the nations of the world can be resolved if only we work together. So this is what is happening. Tinubu is assuring everybody that you know there is opportunity and potential for everyone you know to work together. Back in Nigeria, we saw that uh, Morik stood up against Tinubu and he raised an alarm telling Northern Muslims that Tinubu is working against, you know, the agreed, uh, the agreement saying Tinubu is now choosing Christian, you know, Christians to mount the position of leadership. Meanwhile, they are the ones who fought for him. They are the ones who, you know, said they were the ones who stood up 
when, according to him, the Christians in Nigeria were fighting against the Muslim Muslim ticket. He said this is absurd. So he wants everybody to understand that there is opportunity, okay? Uh -huh. for, for there is opportunity for everyone to work together and to build the nation. He said what's going on is not acceptable at all. You know, he said so he does he's working with competent hands, not whether you are a Muslim or you are a Christian, but with competent hands. You know, he says some people are trying to sell this division, but he will not allow it. So this is what is happening right now. He also met with some Islamic scholars, you know, outside and he said, you know, uh, you, you know, he, he, he wants to work with people who have integrity, who will be able to help to build brothers and sisters. And that, um, you know, everybody must understand that it's God that gives power. We're glad you're saying that, uh, Mr. President. Uh, we're glad to hear that, but we want more, okay? We want you, we want uh, action to begin to, you know, to, to trail our nation so that together people can truly understand the importance of who they are and what they are and what they can bring fresh to the table in order to change the course of what is happening today. Nigeria is in that state, it's in that place where we all must work together without, you know, without letting anybody or anyone hold us back. This nation belongs to us, and we have an opportunity to make a lot of difference. As we speak right about now, we want things to be different, and we want the nation you know, to, to change, and we want things to be better. So uh, Morik is trying to instigate the people or incite the people against Tinubu. Okay? But Tinubu is saying he did not pick anybody because they are Christian, Muslim, or because they are from a particular region that he only picked because he wants competent hands, and that's all. Okay, he wants competent hands, and that's all. Anyway, my lovely, wonderful people, don't forget that you have a voice. And so we all must speak together and end every kind of thing that, you know, is not making us move forward. You know, we must make this nation a better place for every single one of us. Okay, we must make it a better place. This is, you know, this is very important. You know, this is very important, and these are some of the things that are happening. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. Remember, you have a voice. So let's speak out and end everything and anything that will not move us forward as a nation. God bless. Have a good day. From us, is bye for now.